G'day, this is Simon and James at South OC Cars and Coffee. Perfect Southern California day today. Blue skies and a lot of cool stuff. What have you seen, James? Yeah, we have a whole bunch of clubs that came out today. We have a Corvette club, a massive Audi club, and then a Land Rover club as well. Uh, aside from that, we have a bunch of really intricately specced supercars this morning, like a million dollar McLaren 765 LT Spider just all MSO'd out, and a whole bunch of other stuff that we're going to check out. Yeah, and the gorgeous looking classic old Jaguar were pulled in as well. Can't wait to check that thing out too. And don't forget, if you're coming to South OC Cars and Coffee, please remember, no spending, no revving, no burnouts. That's not only coming to the show, but that's also leaving the show as well including getting onto the i5. Please make sure to keep it nice and quiet to keep the neighbours happy. Hey, let's go for a walk and check some stuff out. Here we have a crazy spec 765 LT Spider, one of the most unique colours that I've ever seen for a McLaren, this really interesting metallic flake teal. Uh, it's like a full MSO build as well, you can see MSO on the wing, a fully custom interior as well with these really cool uh, little stitchings on the headrest and just about every option that you could get on this car. Normally I do like the black wheels on these, as you can see the black wheels on a, like a 720 look fantastic, but the silver just works so well with this car with the orange accents. I think whoever spec this today, great job. I guess this is the weekend of the 765 LT Spiders. Here we have another one, this time in chicane effect. I love this color. You can see all the red and gold flake in it when the sun hits it. Just such an awesome color. This one has gorgeous orange accents on it, just like the other teal one. But then it has really nice center seats inside, which are definitely my favorite option for this car. I think this looks absolutely great. This is a very tastefully spec Huracan STO. I remember seeing this one on the dealership floor at Lambo Newport. Kind of has a, uh, a golf livery to it with the orange and the blue. Nice blue accents in the interior as well. Did a great job specking this. I love the matte carbon, very nice touch. Just everything about this car is awesome. Here we have a beautiful Lamborghini Huracan Performante with what I imagine to be just about every single piece of forged carbon that you could possibly get. Hood, splitter, mirrors, roof, A-pillars, wing, literally everything on this car is forged carbon and just to top it off a VF800 supercharger kit. Just such a cool build. Here we have an amazing McLaren 600 LT with a roof scoop. Such an interesting option. You don't really see that too much, but I love that the long tails are offered with that. What a cool car. We have a ton of motorcycles today. Check these out. Nice new uh, BMW over there as well. Some really, really good looking stuff. <laughs> Got to show this Triumph Bobber a bit of love. This is what I would have if I could go and buy a motorcycle tomorrow. I just love this color and everything. These are such a great bike. Classic looking, but I love the fact that they retro everything on these. Same as they did with the Thruxton as well to make it look like that's an old fashioned carburetor. Of course it's not, it's fuel injection, but I uh, just love the stance of this thing. This is super cool. Santa, if you're watching, you can leave one of these under the tree for me this Christmas. Can't walk past this little guy. Look at this beautiful little Isetta. This is a little BMW, of course. These things are pulling huge dollars these days. They are such a cool little car. You actually get in and out of this through the front, almost the windshield opens up. That's the front door. But um, I mean, just such a great little car, great presence. I love these micro cars. Not sure I'd like to, you know, get on the 405 and try and have, you know, cars flying past me at 75, 80 mile an hour. But I'll tell you what, just puttering along PCH along the coast or a back road, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. Love it. I think this thing must be the world's smallest. Woody, check this out. This is a little Morris Miner. What a cute little thing. Tiny little... Uh, 1000 cc motor a friend of mine lived up the road i lived up grew up on a farm and this kid's on another farm 
a little uh, sedan version of these and we used to tear around on the farm. It was the, the most gutless thing I'd ever driven in my life. But this is amazing. Look at all the beautiful coachwork, all the woodwork in this thing. Little picnic set in the back. Gotta love cars like this. They're just really great, aren't they? Lots of fun. James mentioned clubs, this is the first one. All of these Corvettes, check this out, over 30 of them, this group came in. Now remember, if you've got a car club and you want to come to South OC Cars and Coffee, please reach out to us beforehand, like Bob from the Corvette Club did. That way we can bring you in early and park you all together like we have these guys. Check these out. How good is this to see? Good morning. <laughs> good to see you. How are you, brother? Good to see you. Really good. Hey, right. you're so welcome. Thanks for bringing him in. This is so cool. Number one. Number two. Good morning. Number three. How cool is this? This is special, isn't it? Look at that color scheme. Three Koenigs eggs this morning. Tim texted me asking if we had spots for three eggs. The answer, of course, to that question is always yes. We have the CCX, the Regera, and then the Agera RS. Now, I know that you guys are familiar with this Agera and then the CCX, but this Regera is the first time that we've ever had this one at the event. It is probably the craziest spec that I've ever seen. I didn't realize until we got up close, but it is actually a blue carbon weave with a blue interior. Such an amazing job specking this car. I do also love the CCX and the Agera, but this Regera is just something else. One speed transmission, 1500 horsepower, what more could you ask for? From the heathens, got will, got fight, got pride, got reason. If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gonna feed them. If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for a demon. I got eyes in the back of my head, I'm seeing. Take me for granted, and you know I'm leaving. I'ma take what's mine with the webs I'm weaving. I could take this crap from seeing to believing. Got a taste for blood, and my tongue keeps bleeding from the words I spit. So sharp, so freezing, so cold. The whole frostbite they feeling. I could tell you. A pot or I could go heal them Don't believe in faith, don't believe in ceilings I just need a taste and my mind starts peeling I don't pace myself, I grind on kneeling Got lust for change, I just love the feeling uh. I ain't gonna give up Got too little time, I'ma live up Head down, push forward through the tough times Cause anything worth doing is a tough climb And I ain't gonna give up Got too little time, I'ma live up Head down, push forward through the tough times Cause anything worth doing is a tough Cause time Cause I'ma live life for the fight Yeah, I'm here to get it I got drive, got sight Always have a vision I don't lie at night 
I be in my feelings, I'ma be fine Need time and I'll soon be winning I live life for the fight, yeah I'm here to get it I got drive, got sight, always have a vision I go by at night, I be in my feelings I'ma be fine, need time and I'll soon be winning I can feel the blood creeping up from the heathens Got will, got fight that's going to do it for another weekend here at South OC Cars and Coffee. Such an awesome turnout today yeah. and so many great clubs that ended up coming out. Really appreciate you guys supporting the event. Hey, remember, if you want to keep coming to South OC Cars and Coffee, please remember no revving, no speeding, and no burnouts. And that does include coming and going from the show, getting on the freeway. Just make sure that you keep it nice and quiet so that we can keep the neighbors happy. I want to give a huge shout out to all the sponsors for making this event possible. We have Meguiar's, Polestar, Pacific Air Cooled, Next Level Detailing, Teen Road to Safety, RPM Tesla, Aftermarket Accessories, LKQ Pick Your Part, Bridgestone, Roadster, Carbontastic, and then introducing our newest sponsor, MW Company, who is the parent company of brands such as Momo, Weld, Forgedar, and so many more. I do want to give a huge thank you to the volunteers as well for helping us put on this event each and every week. We couldn't do it without them. Remember, if you want to become a volunteer, hit us up on Instagram at South OC Cars and Coffee Merch where we handle all of our volunteer rostering. And then while you're over there, check out some of the new designs that we've got going on. We have a whole ton of stuff coming out very, very soon. And if you are a volunteer, you get to bring your car in early before 8 30 and then Ruby Zina does also supply everyone with a free coffee and donut. Absolutely. Big thank you to Ruby's for doing that. We really, really do appreciate it. And of course, a big thank you to the outlets of San Clemente for allowing us to be here. We could not do that, uh, the show without them. So please remember, if you need to do any shopping, come to the outlets first and make sure to say South OC Cars and Coffee sent you. Big thank you to the City of San Clemente and to the Mayor, Jean James, as well for their support too. Uh, that's it. Hope you've enjoyed it. Have a great week. Don't forget to like, follow, subscribe below. We'll see you back here next week for another South OC Cars and Coffee. Thank you, guys.